All right, Shalom. First off, I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh by Hashem Yahushah, by Hashem Rakhah Kadash. I want to give double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone. And this is it, Shalom to all the Akim out here that's doing and pushing the work in truth and in sincerity. Okay? I want to go on this topic of uh, don't worry about, you know, what you shall say. Okay? Have confidence that the Lord is going to put his word in your mouth. Okay, and that's what the Lord um, said unto, um, you know, many men of the Lord. Okay, um, this is Jeremiah 1 and 4. Then the word of the Lord came unto me, saying, Before I formed you in the belly, I knew you. And before you came forth out of the womb, I sanctified you, and I ordained you a prophet unto the nations. Okay. So when we go out there on the highway and hedges to, to uh, speak, you know, we got to understand that the Lord, the word prophet means to say before, okay? And the fact that, you know, we're even able to stand out there and um and, and speak, you know, speaks, uh, it speaks loud, you know? The fact that we, we, we know this word and that we're able to stand out there on the corners it speaks loud and it says that we we're on the, the right path okay um the lord set us apart okay and this this it says uh then said i i lord god behold i cannot speak for i am a child okay and you got you know somebody who may um be young in the faith okay you may be someone who just you know, came into the camp or whatever the case may be, you know, and you, you get put on the um, spot to uh, to speak or to say something, you know, this, this is goes for you. It says, but the Lord said unto me, say not I am a child, for you shall go to all that I send you, and whatsoever I command you, you shall speak, okay? So you're not, you shouldn't worry about, you know, um, being a child or not knowing much, you know, oh, we were, I just did a video on, on about the milk, you know, and, and, you know, basically we should be speaking like, yo, we want to get the hell, it's a lot of stuff to talk about, you know, but the, the fact is that whatever, whatever is meant for you, if, if the Lord wants to send you someone who, who, who is meant to get it, then he'll send you someone that's meant to get it. Okay, uh, and he'll put his words in your mouth, so we just have to believe that the Lord, okay, is is controlling everything. It says, Be not afraid of their faces, for I am with you to deliver you, saith the Lord Yahweh. So, we have to we have to have this mentality that the Lord is with us, okay, when we out there on, on the streets, that the Lord is with us, you know. It says, Then the Lord put forth his hand and touched my mouth. And the Lord said unto me, Behold, I have put my words in your mouth. Okay, so don't worry about what you will say when you out there on the um, highway and hatches. The Lord is going to, you know, he's going to make it to where you um, say what he wants you to say. He's going to put that spirit on you to bring out whatever it is he wants you to bring out. Okay, he told that to Jeremiah. This is what he told um, uh, Moses, uh, Exodus four and ten. And Moses said unto the Lord, "O my Lord, I am not eloquent, neither here to for, nor since thou hast spoken unto your servant, but I am sl slow of speech, and of a slow tongue." Okay, it don't matter whether you talk with a slur or um, if you tongue tied it. Um, if you don't know all of the, the, the words as far as um, the definition of words, okay, um, you might not be the, 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 in your eyes, the best speaker, okay? But the Lord will put that spirit on you to say what you're going to say, and, and this is what he said. If you, have, if you feel like you got a speech problem, okay, don't worry about what you got to say or how it, how it comes out. And the Lord said unto him, 
who has made man's mouth or who makes the dumb or the deaf i mean or deaf or the seeing or the blind have not i the lord so the lord has made you to be the way that you are okay so you just have to realize that this is this is how the lord made me okay and this is what he said now therefore go and i will be your mouth and teach you what you shall say okay so the lord the lord will um will will uh put his words in your mouth you just have to to trust and believe because that's what's going to happen okay um this is uh ezekiel 3 and uh uh 4 it says uh and he said unto me son of man go get you unto the house of israel and speak with my words unto them for you are not sent to a people of strong i mean of strange speech and of a hard language but to the house of israel so we when we speak to these people out here on the highway and hedges they they know uh um uh what what language we're speaking you know we speak in the same language that they speaking you know it's not it's not like they can't understand what we saying okay not too many people of a strange speech and of a hard language whose words thou canst not understand Surely I have sent you to them, they would have hearkened unto you. Okay? So the Lord sent us on, you know, sent us out there, you know. But these these people understand what we saying. Okay? And it don't matter whether, you know, um we have a crowd out there or not. It says, But the house of Israel will not hearken unto you, for they will not hearken unto me. For all the house of Israel are impudent and hard-hearted, okay? And that's what we really should be focused on, you know? Teaching the ones that, that want to get it. You know, we rebuke those who who um, don't want to get it, you know? But that's just, that, that comes with the experience and everything like that of being a, a, a speaker, okay? And the Lord putting his words in your mouth. It says, Behold... I have made your face strong against their faces and your forehead strong against their foreheads. So these people can't really can't really mess with us, man, when it comes down to this truth. You gotta you gotta know and believe that we have angels that are that are encamped around us to um protect us, man. Okay? Every day, you know. And especially when we go out there at camp. You know that that we we're protected from Yahweh by Shimon Shah, and if you haven't faith in in the Lord, then that you know that shows that you special. You know you have faith in the Lord, so you, the Lord ain't gonna leave you out there, you know, hanging to dry. You know you speaking His word. You know it says, "Is adamant harder than flint? Have I made your forehead fear them not? Neither be dismayed at their looks, though they be a rebellious house." Moreover, he said unto me, Son of man, all my words that I shall speak unto you, receive in your heart and hear with your ears. Okay? So the Lord speaks unto pe people individually. Okay? And and what you receive from the Lord, okay? From the Lord, you bring that out. Okay? When, when, when all of these men, okay, uh, had these, you know, situations that, that occurred, you know, they are, these are all testimonies, okay, separate accounts of how, you know, the Lord came through, okay, came through for, for the men that, 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 that stood firm, man, okay, um, and, and we coming upon a time where, um, we, we gonna, we gonna get, taken up you know what I'm saying from from these uh these people out here okay this is uh matthew 10 and uh 16 behold i send you forth as sheep in the midst of wolves be ye therefore wise as serpents and harmless as doves but beware of men for they will deliver you up to the councils and they will scourge you in their synagogues and you shall be brought before governors and kings for my sake for a testimony against them and the Gentiles. 
But when they deliver you up, take no thought how or what you shall speak. For it shall be given you in that same hour which you shall speak. For it is not you that speak, but the Spirit of the Father which speaks in you. Okay? So we have to realize when we go out, we just vessels, man. You know? We just vessels and we we doing the will of the Heavenly Father when we go out there and we teach and we, we do videos. You know? And and the Lord is with us, you know. Have that have that confidence, you know, and don't worry about what you what you shall say because the Lord gonna put whatever is meant for you to say at that specific time, you know. And you know you got brothers there that that'll help you out, you know. This is all a, a body, you know. So with that, you know, Lord willing, this is uh, edifying. I want to say uh, shalom till next time.